Hey everyone, this is Bryce with Wink Sound. I'm going to be showing you how to create a comp track. What we're going to do is we're going to take uh, each one of those takes and make a final cut for our lead vocal for this course that we were doing. If you remember from the last tutorial, if we go up to playlist, there's our three tracks. So what we're going to do is go up here next to the track name. We're going to click new. We're going to name this uh, Vox Comp. Click OK. Go back here to Playlists. And there's our three takes. What we're going to do now is we're going to go section by section and pick the best takes. You can also do this for pretty much anything you, know, you want to do. Record it a bunch of times and then take your pick of what you want and you turn it into one track. We're going to hit the solo here. This solo is going to play this track plus the guitar track. So we're going to take a listen to the first part here. If only you look into my eyes. Alright, so take a listen to the second one. If only you look into my eyes. And third one. The third one kind of sounded the best to me. Take this part here. And then you see this arrow. Now what this arrow is going to do is when I click it, it's going to throw it up into this track here. So we click the arrow. And that section that we chose from take three goes up here to our comp track. We're just going to go with one this time. Now we have all the takes, take the solo off, close this back up to waveform. If only you look into my eyes and see the pain you've left inside. If only you could reach my soul, you'd see that I'm not whole. After that, what you would do is uh, create fades and edit it and make sure everything sounded good without those pops and spaces in between. So if you have any questions, you can hit me up on Twitter at Bryce Abrick. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.